Hello everybody, so we have a new SCP Roleplay update coming in around a week from when I'm recording this. So by the time this video is out, it's still going to be a week because I think I can edit it quick. Anyways, uh, we know that this update is coming on the 21st of August and it's going to be the biggest update in SCP Roleplay history. It's going to be Roleplay update and recently they just put out the announcement trailer so I'm actually kind of late to this, shame on me. But let, let's watch it, let's see what's new. At least what's coming, because they haven't told us everything. Okay, so we see the game logo at the start. Then MetaMethod Studios. So this is the helipad. So not much, just a transition. Hold on, if we just go back. Maybe this is like a new area? This area? I don't remember seeing it. I think it's near the control room, or oh, this could be a new place. So SCP-049 is, you know, doing what it does. Okay, this is new. There's a lot of caves, I think. So they have new site attachments for the guns prestige so i think it's going to be used alongside credits as a currency achievements okay okay this is getting fast so not quality <laughs> playback speed let's just put this on like really low so we can see it custom server expansion a new facility a medical department additions new recontainment method cdc activities scd clipboard able sword tool whatever that is a new gun configuration UI. That that might be really good, I guess. Cosmetics. Side policies. Okay, I think this might work by like ADs or ADs or O5s, you know. Changing side policy, but I'm interested to know how that works. Oh. Did you guys just see that? Hold on, hold on. I need to go back there. Okay, AD slash O5 tablet. This is going to be interesting. I wonder what we could do on that. Janitor system. Janitor system. That is a big deal. Over 200 changes. Over 200 changes. That is big. Okay, I think we can return this to normal speed. Playback speed normal. So we have new Chaos Insurgency Caves. And I think they've changed the spawn area up a little bit. I think it looks good. Oh, okay, this this looks really nice. A cave, yeah, this was just needed, come on. That didn't look realistic at all. The vents, like, come on. New facility, I like this. Facility, I guess. Oh, 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 okay. This is interesting. So it says welcome, and then your username. This person's Scorpio0270. We can check the site status, so no more of asking in radio about it or going to a computer there. Site policies. I'm really interested in what that could do. Like, could that set new laws? If so, then it's a great addition to the AD team, which is absolutely nothing right now. It's just AD, I guess. And tasks, cameras. Okay, so now we don't have to go to the control room to see our cameras. Request Alpha One if they're online. So that's interesting. I like the design of the tablet. To Prometheus Labs Incorporated, SCP Foundation use only. That's that's a good uh, detail touch. Ooh, so so we have these two TVs. Okay. And it says, relieve stress and anxiety by participating in scheduled sessions of SCP-999. And there's a person, so I think it's an NPC, where you can just click to check in. That's interesting. Ooh, you can do research? Oh, oh okay, okay. Previously, SCDs, like, the game is lacking roleplay these days, you know. Most of people treat it like PvP only, and it's not PvP. I, I'm, I'm even surprised that some people who play SCP Roleplay, in fact, 
they don't even know what the SCP Foundation is. So this is just like doubling down. This is important because the scientific department team is like my least favorite team to play on because it's just will the CDs be willing to test or will they just get out a gun and start killing you because of no roleplay? That's just FRP fail roleplay. But now we got this. I think it's just really good. It's a nice checklist. Good clipboard. I like the design. Oh, okay. So the CDC looks better, I guess. They have these bridges from the top. Oh, there's a new area there. I, I really wonder what that area could be. I think it's like an extended CDC. I mean, obviously, it's an extended C CDC. Or could it be a connection to the other side? Like, another side of the side. So, these attachments are good. I like this one. New recontainment. This is so necessary. I cannot even hint on how. You just hope that no one else would come or something bad would happen. Ranked what? So, this is where all the PvPers can go. Because the reason they didn't play on traitors was because, you know, or infection, because they like to play in the map itself, not that map. So, this is important. I think they've composed some new tracks for the game. Reworked SCPs. Oh my god. Able Sword to them. Okay, that, that that looks interesting. But I really don't know how that'll put up with the guns. Is it just like a special sword? Prestige Cosmetics. Okay, so you can buy cosmetics with Prestige. There's my Dittable Index going there. <laughs> Infection Mode Editions. Oh my. I actually like Infection Mode. It's not so liked because you can't do too much, but I think it's fun. SCP-3000, I don't know. I'm not a fan of this mode, especially since it replaced traders, and I kind of like traders, and so did many people in the community. And SCP-3008 is already a game, so it's kind of like copying it, but I don't know. Maybe it could teleport you from the site. I want, like, server size to increase. Maybe a bit more. Because 40 is a bit less for the site. Come on. 079 hack event. And a lot, lot more. This area is very new. I'm, I feel like they might be adding like a new, completely new portion. Not a rework. Completely new portion of the site. Or even a separate site. That's just like right next to it. I mean. It's definitely possible, as this is the biggest update that the game ever had, so I can't see why that's not possible. And this is... The, not that. Something relating to SCP-079. So, that's the roleplay update that's coming on the 21st of August. But that's not it. We've got a full plan. So, this is the update announcement that was given on the 11th of August. I'm recording this video on, hold on, the 13th of August. Yes, I don't remember the day. I'm kind of done. Today, in a few hours, which it, they're going to be releasing the mini-series trailer. And, basically, I, I have no idea what that's going to be. But they've put a video with a thumbnail of SCP-079, which I'll just cut to in a second. But... Then they have the SCPs trailer on the 15th of August. Then the miniseries epilogue, whatever the miniseries is, on the 17th of August. On the 19th of August, they're going to have the ranked mode trailer. And the 21st of August, we, the day we're all going to be waiting for, there's going to be the update release and the video. Now, I'm going to be one of the first YouTubers out there to even post information about the updates to uncover the deep dark secrets, which are being hidden in these videos because there's obviously a lot of things there. And that, that means you really just got to subscribe. C come on, hit, hit the bell icon as well. You, you need the notifications to know and you can stay on track. But 
for the next update video that I'm uploading very soon. You can see this. Hold on. Mechanical rebinding trailer. It has SCP-079. Now, obviously, I don't know what, what on earth this is. And the premiere is in three hours. So, please, if let me know in the comments if you know. Because, yeah, this is going to be insane. And, yeah, this update is going to be fire. Because when you have an update that has, like, look at how many trailers this update has. We had the teaser before. Hold on, let's go back to this timeline. Okay, we got it. When you have an update trailer, uh, I mean an update, which has one not not one but not two not three not four not five not six but even seven videos about it from the official studio it, it's gonna be a big one it's gonna be a big one i mean it's the biggest update in scp world Boys history and i really think we need this update the community needs it because honestly speaking we've been waiting since december of last year that's been Oh my god, I spent nine months. Nine months. That's that's the amount of time a baby spends in the stomach. And that's how long we've been waiting for this update. So it's gonna be a lot of hype. Which is why you gotta subscribe. Like I'm taking the advantage. Go go, go subscribe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching. Have a nice day.